God, my throat. Ooh, click button. Right, hey guys, it's your boy Flame Ninja. Hope you're having a fairly good, fairly good day myself. And today, bit of an early stream because I don't have work today, which is very nice. <laughs> so I thought I'll do an early stream today uh, and we can just go on where we were. As I said last stream, uh, I'm of course doing Honkai Impact today because uh, fucking chapter 31 was amazing. <laughs> the ending of chapter 31 was super fucking hype. So, uh, of course, I'm going to be continuing doing Honkai, and we're going to be jumping into chapter 32, which is basically, from what I know, like the beginning of the final story arc for part one of Honkai, which is going to be fucking cool. <clears throat> no, it's fuck your games. Seely's Amazing Kitchen. What the fuck are you on about, game? No, I don't want to enter Seely's fucking kitchen. She's a pretty good cook. What's this? You get a you get a portrait. I'm so confused about a lot of this. Wait, have I been getting like rewards and just give me my rewards? I didn't play the game, but give it. I this is a lot of I'm just clicking buttons at this point. I don't know what the fuck's going on. So Sealy's night concert. <laughs> there are so many fucking random events just on the main menu, and I'm so confused. Summer Street Shopping Court. <laughs> Fuck. Does that play the event to get two costumes? Well, I'm a bit fucking late in that. Bucket Bowler. Choose one from 12 outfits. I want to see what the outfits I can choose from. Because I probably don't care, to be fair. I wish you could view the outfit. Oh, wait, here. It's uh, here. Uh, uh, I wish it just showed me which ones. You should choose to see the outfit. I can't read. Either way, we're just going to be continuing with the main story. Uh, so let's actually bring the screen over and go from there. The game is also very loud because I think I turned up for the, the cutscene. Or at least turned up my... Oh, wait, I think I just turned up the dial on my speakers. <laughs> Either way, whatever... Chapter 32, the day of transcending finality, end of the world. <clears throat> this is going to be interesting because this is going to be the culmination of everything where I'm guessing we're going to the moon. Seely? <gasps> Seely! Oh my god, it's been such a long time since I've seen the, old, the actual main characters. Is that... Kevin? What the fuck? What happened to him? Oh. Doesn't he have a sword? Well, I'm assuming that's Kevin because of the fire. Oh, there's the sword. What the fuck happened to Kevin? Why is he like half Honkai Beast now? <laughs> Seely? You okay, my girl? <laughs> Young girl's unconscious clutched at her chest like a small animal had been stalked by beasts. The terror in her dream still haunted her. Hmm. The girl paused. She had only realized how foreign the place she was at looked down. She was in a mysterious cabin devoid of any signs of life. 
It was empty with no windows, and the room seemed like an overturned metal can. It was quiet and dark, cramped space for the girl. There's a lone door that led to the unknown. Hmm. Uh oh. Oh, he found a sign surrounded her. The same silence was the only response she got. An inexplicable fear crept over the girl's heart. Unlike how confused she was, she had just awoken. The emptiness within her made her tremble uncontrollably. The consciousness that stirred the same body with her past contradictions and irreplaceable of herself. The young girl could not imagine of everything. <gasps> Nobody replied. The young girl's heartbeat echoed in the empty room as if a strange feeling just now was simply her imagination. But she knew that was her. Of course, there's no reply, but that heartbeat from deep within her conscious calm, like a wordless comfort. The girl imagined how a certain someone would respond at this moment, gave him a horological smile. Interesting. The girl composed herself and walked towards the only door. Before she did anything, the door silently slid open, revealing a quiet, dark corridor. This is like the Grey Serpent place. Celia took a deep breath as she looked at the shadow corridor that had no end in sight. There was a momentary silence this time. There was no one to give her suggestions by her side. She had to make her own decision. Interesting how we're starting with Celia. There's a random fucking child there. There's a random child. And a random guy in a suit. I would assume we're in some sort of serpent lab. Oh no, they're also been kidnapped. Hmm. Very confusing start. Well, the chapters tend to start quite slow, so we'll see how it goes. Hmm. Project Stigma. I know it was Kevin's goal to like nuke the city to force Project Stigma slash Project Mantis. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Oh shit, it's fucking bonk. No clue. Oh no, Sealy. Sora! After meeting I said the infamous girl suddenly seemed a little embarrassed. Sora, yeah, from um Natasha's stuff, right? Camping room. I expect to answer evidently everything before her was nothing like the camp that Celia was familiar with. Natasha? Oh, what are you doing, Natasha? Disappearing right by now.勝手に行っとこかい、ちょっとね。キャンプ地から離れちゃダメ。キャンプに参加したことはあまりないけど。そう。本当のキャンプはこんな感じじゃないでしょ。それにここは月の上。おう。この建物を捨てたことは。おう
Inferring Elysian Idol. I have the deep, yeah. Girl's disappointed face, CD felt bad. Part of <laughs> Tilly should be good at this. The two big sisters. Oh, Rosa and Lilia. Oh, wait, one with blonde hair and one with black hair. Blonde would be Durandal. Black is May? Even though black, she kind of has purple hair. Still began to wear a child expression. Valkyrie. Marked. Yes. That's oh, that's a lot of fucking loading. Control mouse. We. Oh, what the fuck is this about? Inventory. Owned items. I own rock. Perfect. Uh, this is a lot of strong guy rewards to get enough sodium check out the milestone missions here tap for more details something like you 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 do the chapters so yeah this is chapter 23 so basically, I'm just going to do this and ignore everything else. <laughs> because a lot of the other stuff is mainly for people who are doing this, like, as it releases. <laughs> Daily task for person for and completing for rewards. Let's try accepting the task. So basically, this is like a mini version of... Um... The open world. Don't I have that? Oh, I need that. Talk to Sora. Can't jump here, sadly. Necessary, but also. Didn't save a long soon after I said I could find a way home. I went to tell him to teach you stay here. I said to take up the other children in the roost. Hmm. Hmm. I'm assuming it's May and Durandal. Because if it's... But May left. Oh, it's another fucking open world one. Ah, but we get the funny! Right, Seelie is, of course, Quantum. Uh, I prefer Ride and May. And then for... Mech, we only really have you. Track the target. Explore onward. On to the moon! I do, I, I am happy though that in the later chapters they return to just the level format where you, you know, it's just levels instead of open world. So I feel like the levels definitely are a lot better for the Honkai formula. The open worlds feel very tacked on, but kind of feel like experimenting for like Genshin. That's mainly because the open worlds pad a lot of just walking about. The angry cliff is the remnants of the sky on both sides, pulling everything into a heavy gloom. Not a living soul, not a sound, nothing but wil wilderness within sight. She believed Sora was telling the truth. Only the lifeless sight saddened her. The giant blue planet reflected a light as clear as water gazed upon each other. 
It was an intimate f and familiar blue. So familiar, in fact, it struck a feeling akin to fear in her, especially when it was covered in on. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was going to say. The moon projects to Marta, unlike Sora, who thought she was really camping. Seely certainly understood the weight those words carried. She remembered Dr. Einstein had told her, in the previous era, humans had gone to the moon and intercepted the final Hersha there, if this was the site of that battle. Then the organization that sent Sora to the camp could only be the one independent of anti-entropy and Shixel, World Serpent. And this interference could explain why she dreamed of a man that resembled oh, Kevin. Before she could think further, an eerie energy fluctuation appeared, approached her. Quantum shadows, yeah, interesting. Oh, is Viola actually here though? Yeah. Oh god, I do like this battle suit quite a bit because it's just fucking. Rah. I like the giant claws; they're pretty badass. Strange, these monsters are exactly the same as the enemies I meant. Oh wait, again. Yeah, Durandal and May, from the sounds of it, unlocks after oh, I went the wrong way. That's why I'm going to switch between running and walking. Oh. Oh, it's so nice that we just control it. So it's just okay to start enter this quick travel to new locations. Oh, sweet. I don't think I meant to do that. <laughs> These monsters have already lost all energy. Yeah, break as someone just beamed them all. Can you give us details on the marks? Like hoof stem? Oh. Uh oh. He's alive. Oh, nice try, bitch boy. Bogin le bonk. Killer fucker. Much more prefer this mode. What's this? Thought it was a bounce pad for a second. Uh oh, up the other hill. We, oh we can jump! Oh thank god. Cold weapons. Rita? So Rita's here? But Rita doesn't have black hair or blonde hair. Rita has grey hair. Cold black hair. Sushang has brown hair. Oh. Wait, but they said black hair. Sushang clearly has brown hair. There must have been a translation error. In high ground. Girls leapt and landed softly next to Seely. Yay. ちょっとそんな距離のある呼び方はやめてよ。あんたより少しと周辺のだけだし、お姉さん。え、フィルス。冗談だ。いや、私そう言ってコールインプロニアです。この時代に対する理解。マンチャーでサイクルアウト。フ
でも二人はと私も似たような感じかな。予約した部屋の扉を開けた途端、このわけのわからないところにそう。SF 小説みたいにね。最初は宿や。ホタウイン、キシノイスト、ボディーター、ダスファン。私もゼールさんと同じように、両親の海に出入りしたことがありますが。いや。しかし、数少ない良い知らせもあります。Oh. ええ、今のところ、リタや地球にいる。ホリーブレイド。おやくせ、コネクティビアだ。今は。Yeah. Do they have a similar thing then? Kevin? Some of the day. Oh, sorry, there is a message. You may not know. I don't know why he transformed though. Cocoto ni tail mossy. Carry on, Kevin, he chokes it out the Sasagani Mucha that they eat a kiddo. Huh? Saki Hotomade, such a nice to Konochako, Tansakus Tetandis. Who are definitely part of the pay, some strange rocks and a useless broken bridge. Roshan's eye is blocked by some weird energy. If you're powerless. Oh, that's right. I mean, yeah, how they breathe in. Maybe if it's possible, the virus of the world is so tight to spare. Hmm. That's why it's so hard to spare. That's why it's so hard to spare. Yes. Prisoners are left behind those who are stigma awakened like us and eliminated. Even the people so. But what about Earth? Don't you say Kondia tried to just read to seem normal? Yes. The project soon is greatly different from what we know it to be. Are they going to try and stigmata the entire planet? <laughs> Kevin's kind of gone off the deep end. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, we got the squad. <laughs> Take the elevator to the top floor. Is there a church up here? I love fucking uh, space sky boxes. What's this? Oh, it's just a map. They don't feel like it, they feel like quantum. I've had some practical functions in the distance past. I don't know if that's necessarily. Oh! Shwink! It's weird not having an X button. Like, no X ability. What if I... Oh, I can charge attack, but it doesn't really do much without the full bar. Swing. Oh, fuck, he's not dead. Die, you little rat. Oh, wait, you're weak to them. Oh, yeah, I forget, because, like, stuff is weak to its own, like, thing. Oh, no, it's because that's imaginary, and imaginary and quantum are, like, the reverse. They're strong against themselves, but weak against each other. Oh wait, shit, it's still alive. I didn't realize. There's the next skill. Fuck them up. Oh shit, we got more. Oh wait, they're still imaginary, so I'm not going to be able to do much. I mean, you probably, maybe we can just DPS high enough that the game doesn't care about the weakness. I 
I like how it builds in reverse. So like you're first building the white bar and then you're building the red bar. Bonk. I mean, I have my own imaginary characters. They're just not very well built. So I can't really use them. Goody Kata. Sure. Spencer, the energy left in these balls is Honkai energy. Oh, it's pure just Honkai energy then. It's probably from when the uh, Hersha erupted on the moon, I would assume. Yeah, when the final Hersha awakened on the moon, it probably left all this shit just from its power. Right, and you can stop drawing your sword, you know. I would assume Kevin, who's just going around attacking him. Oh, you, the dog woman from World Serpent. That's the woman from World Serpent with the dog mask, the evil one. Yep. Jackal, that's her name. Yep. Fortune, Valkyrie Bianca. It's got a small talk. We're tired, oh. <laughs> yeah, considering you're the one who wanted to nuke the city and tried and also tortured Kiana. Dragon walked out in a stereotype. <laughs> left on Earth. The hunting season's over. Hmm. This has already been completed. Real and imaginary space. Oh. Gives a funny thing together. They will shatter the order that humans had. Everyone just wait for a new order to spend upon this world. Isn't it right? As the chosen ones, we can witness everything clearly with incredible fortitude. Oh, yeah, as I thought, Kevin is wiping out everyone who isn't Stigmata awakened. Uh, pretty much why he talks about how he. He's he kind of betrayed Eliza. New or is that Eliza? I forget. She's not made him suffer. あらゆる欲望が満たくとしてその過程で彼らは成婚として虚数空間に沈み。待って。その前の世に沿って彼らは実態を失い、その永遠に続く夢の中で。they pretty much get to be put into like an infinite dream world. Lucifer is already a blessing for them. Jackal paused and showed for her usually haunty expression. Since I've explained, there's no need for me to hide anything else. Mm. Can we realize today only because of the technology that Sire retained from the previous era? So, Kevin, this technology cr created hair, created a second life for Serpent to catch dreams. Kiana? <laughs> she was Serpent. Mm. 
時効が終わった後私は孫子と共に去る恐れく孫子にとってさらなる計画誰も来ず Unreachable, uninvadable space. Well, that's not the first time in fucking Honkai Impact that we've gone to a unreachable, unobtainable place. I mean, I'm pretty sure we've probably done that at least 20 times in this fucking game at this point. あんたたち、孫子の考えは私たちが勝手にそうだよ。孫子は私たちを必要としていたわけではなく、だが、あんたたちに教えた話この時代の最近の時代は、あんたたちに教えた話は、あんたたちに教えた話は、あんたたちに教えた話は、あんたたちに教えた話は、あんたたちに教えた話は、あんたたちに教えた話は、あんたたちに教えた話は、あんたたちに教えた話は、現状を確かに私たちはデスフパワーに崩壊を承認させることは人類を滅ぼしていい理由にはなるどうりであのと思うあんたたちに見かけてみたら確かに私はケビンとフッキンドランなケビンキアーナが一番ソロケビンとの時間の時間を過ごしたことはとにかく今の私たちは2年の違いです孫子の絶対的な力の前では In his opinions. Again, they, this is all just the same shit they said about Otto, and guess where he is? Fucking dead. Many moths born in the wrong era bound to perish in flames. Turn around and walk down the mountain. After taking two steps, she durably waves her hand and traces a circle behind her. <coughs> I was about to say, how did she summon enemies? Where's progress of all the Honkai energy leaking out that beasts are just being spawned? Well, she said she would surrender, but she didn't, the lying bastard. Chwink. I don't know why they treat Kevin as such an amazing hero, to be fair. Because he hasn't really done anything. Like, yeah, he fought the Honkai, but hasn't, like, every single character here. I feel like most of the main cast has probably fought more Honkai than Kevin has, at least face to face, from what we've seen. まさかあのケビンが夜ムンガンの幹部を辞めさせるなんてね避難所を出てから私たちの探索も全部そうなるともしあのジャッカル彼らの目的を避難所を出てから私たちの探索も全部そうなるともしあのジャッカル彼らの
She picked up a stone on the ground for it towards the broken bridge. The stone followed a regular trajectory, but disappeared at the peak of its track. <laughs> yeah, she could have been fucking Zorked. <laughs> As she spoke, the Valkyrie flushed out. Genius, yeah, the device. She had a strong bomb where the witch was from her, like, whole memory scape thing. She had not yet realized how unintent this unintentional act would bring her an unexpected discovery. Huh. When she was standing, the Valkyrie walked a few steps toward the broken bridge. There, she analyzed Genius's readings. Oh, Celia has the ability to like rip open holes in like dimensions, so maybe. Perfect. Oh, yeah, I forget she inherited Sumeru. Space had reached out before the girls died, but they had regained their senses. A towering sacred fig tree had already appeared in front of them. <coughs> yeah, this is Sue's dimension. Yeah. <coughs> ダイニの神の鍵のために作った観測地球上では自由に出入り可能でしたが月の空間構造に今成功させられたのは乱境の空間以上しかしなぜゼーレさんのこういう波動で。シーリーイエス。そんなに話してるけど、いいたとえ方
Yep, same with I'm with you, Shu Chang. こうして通信が可能になりましたから、ただそこは月なのです。月が支配ヤンカさん、その場合、私たちはですので、シュレーディンガ博士、両氏の海の。そうなのです。うん。こちら側の信号探索結果を見ると、月の近く。水の素数。
This is like the Sea of Quant after Bronya got her Hush of Reason powers. What's this? Oh, it's Bronya. And Dr. May? Oh, do you know Venti is in Kaya Planet Quest? I have to do his hangout now. <laughs> mm. Ghost images. Three scientist looking people in the bubble universe. もしかしたらあなたと世界のあなたも私のように自身を but everything inside side. Sealy. <coughs> hmm. Yes. Let's check out the records. Let's go. Pew. Where are we now? Uh oh, it's evil Bakugan! It's evil snails! Whatever will I do against the evil snails? Except murder them. Because I've been. Mean, I don't really. I can't like fucking debate with them for some reason. No pacifism against the Sea of Quant. You quantum bastard. Oh shit. We I didn't even get a choice there. Oh, Vilvi. So Yep, Dr. May, as I thought. Project Ember. Yes. Hmm. Number 17. なんとなく避難所の話だったなのですね。いつまりこの時代の人間が待って。火を追う。そのまま月が支配する世界の穴の中には火を。いえ、もしかしたら全文明の人たちは聖婚覚醒者が月に。<笑> Yeah。それに。あちゃ、噂をすれば影が。はい。ゲニウスが表示する座標が。はい。よく見てくださいなのです。これらの国際根系わからないなのでだから。はい。As uh, soon as Schrödinger speaks, I just want to skip their dialogue cuz as soon as as soon as Schrödinger starts going, uh, yes, the spatial bubbles in the intermediate dimension, I just want to skip their dialogue. Oh, I, this is a new design. Oh, there they are. They'll be in number 17, I guess. Oh, that's a different personality of VLV. How's your finality? Pardo? 
What are you doing here, Pardophelis? Oh, there she goes. What the... What, why? Why? What? I'm very confused. Is she leading Seelie somewhere? Oh. あの女は終焉の律者を休眠状態にして。そうだけど。そう。あ。休眠の律者を休眠状態にして。そうだけど。あ。それでもきっと彼女はただ。死刑を処罰する。あなたたちの縁。エリシアがかつて私たち古武術
throw Kiana to wake her up. Huh? Control. Oh. Oh, she's never been to the Sea of Quant. Dreamed. Hmm. This. Control Kiana to look around. Huh? That's interesting that it's saying Kiana. Uh-oh. Is this past Bronya? Oh, Hacker Bunny. What the? Oh, because bubble universes are colliding. Therefore, Hacker Bunny's here. Hence the I'm controlling you. It's Brony. Yeah, it's, it's not Bronya, it's Brony. So Brony's like hacked into Kiana's subconscious. That does sound like fucking Senti's laugh. Oh, hi, Senti. Bye, Senti. Yeah, but off. Give Kiana a suggestion. Which is, this isn't a dream. Oh. We. Oui. Yeah, Kiana's never been to see a quant. Hey, Mihoyo! Make sure you look at the company when you battle. Oh shit, I can't use my Hersha powers. I mean, that's fine, Kiana. You've, you've been doing a lot of training, right? Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, I remember. This is the awesome version where you don't get any, like, void damage. You can just spam the charge attack. I remember that. This is the really good battle suit where you can just... There's, like, no reason to use the guns because you can just... Just spam attack. I love how she's using, like, a broken sword. She's using Himiko's broken sword. It's so badass. I think, like, broken... But oh, that is a... Weird shadow, to say the least. Kiana need tongue. Oh, that is a big boy. Bonk. 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 Ah, you fucker. I was comboing you. One sec, I need to... I want to change the volume a bit. The little bell, 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 which reminds me of old dubstep. Uh-oh. Run ya! It's quantum shadows. Yeah. yeah, it was Brony. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> ah. Kevin! 
give Kiana. True, yeah, all of our talking will be useless if we can't fucking leave the bubble. Yeah, the quantum beast trying to fucking murder us. Just kill them. Oh, this is one of the really bad Bronya suits where you have the fucking laser. I really don't like that suit. I prefer the cannon one where you like charge up and then you do the massive shot, the like one shot. <laughs> Die! They must be heading towards something. No, not the snail and the scorpion! He's holding a rock! Watch out, he's holding a rock! Ow, prick. You have enough evidence to make that claim. I don't know why they put text in the middle of combat, really. God, this fuck is resilient. If only I had my burst, I could just fucking delete this guy. Come on. There we go. All I got speed immediately out of combat and I've already dashed. Oh, oh there's a gap! あそこが海縁の目みたいに。でも、こいつ、うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。
a bottleneck end up defeated by such needless self-blame and hyper-competitiveness. Yeah, because Bronya had a whole like character arc about how <clears throat> she did fucking nothing. Try attacking. Okay. Nothing. Blame waste my power. Reveal the weak spot in space to Kiana. What? Did this just appear? There's someone clearly here guiding Kiana. And I don't know if it's Brony. But it's got like Brony energy. Oh, now you've both been kafunkled. Hey! Fire blow caused, uh, tear caused by the quantum shadow of the empty space before Kiana's shadow revealing an entrance to another world. But she became inaudible as happens when two different pressures collide and virtual irresistible first pulled her into the rift. In the blink of light, the only thing remained were her shrieks still lingering in the air. It was also before then she realized why Bronya emphasized practicing falling before leaving. Senti. Reputated even though she did not with the power of the void, she had many other ways to land safely. It would hurt a little, but not to the point of making her gasp again. Due to a limited theoretical layer, she could not realise that she had crossed a considerable distance by means similar to warping in the Sea of Quanta. If distance meant the same as Sea of Quanta that it did in the proper world, but in terms of results, she made the right judgement. So just her posture and attempt to slow her descent and thus have more time to look for an answer. But this was unnecessary as the stranger was too conspicuous. During her full hundreds of quantum shards had collapsed. That had collapsed rolls as if they were souls returning to the heavens. Apparently they had tasted the harrowing defeat. The mere repercussion of that battle could lift her hair against the wind like high voltage. What sort of power could achieve that? She should be able to. Oh, she could not command her authority at will. As long as she focused on attacking her thinking she could wreck the quantum shards. But by that standard... She suddenly felt phasey but sturdy hunch. Almost reflectively, Kiana's body and mind relaxed on their own. She no longer needed to worry about how to counter ambushes or land smoothly because she could feel it. This is all about Fua's training! The full of momentum stopped. Her hunch was about to come true. <laughs> May! <gasps> Yay! Mm -hmm. Yo, they're back together! The lesbians are back together! Fuck yeah! Then came the customary silence. It was not an awkward moment. Are they gonna kiss? Do it. Do it. Because it's the same for anyone. If a heart looked forward to a reunion, it would rehearse it over and over again. It would ponder how to say the first sentence, how to express its ache and joy, and how to respond to another's care. Anyone would want the special moment to be perfect, but anyone would suddenly feel powerless to break this thin silence like them. Because everyone could hardly notice one thing at this moment. Everyone who yearned for a reunion had never truly been apart. It's so good to see them back together. It's been... What? Since chapter 17? It's been like 15 chapters.
Right, before we continue, and I'm happy that these two have returned, I need to grab a drink again. I'm back. Let's continue. Serve in reality again. Masaka. <laughs> でもそう考えたとりあえず今は。そうしとしと。だいじょうぶ。ここは両親の私に任せて。ギブとメイ。ウィ。ウィ。うん。ワン。<笑> Yes. Oh, she's right here. <laughs> Hi, Franya. It's great to see you together. Strangely shook off quantum show and strangely discovered the break of detail to the spatial connection point behind the two of you. There's some form of guidance from destiny, yeah. Hmm. Oh, that might be why Senti's here. Yeah, Face a mysterious destruction. Create a situation. Mm. It's a field of vague guidance from the Sea of Quant. I've yet to exert any influence on her. それはきっと私をどこか邪魔しに来た漁師の影の数が私たちが感じた存在が同じものかは分からないけど。というより、この導きに従ったから合流できたのかもしれません。うん。It's hmm. so good having the girls back together though. It's so good. 導きって一体何なの? 正確に言うと、それは人為的に作られた空間のほころびで。
There's a glowy orb. Let's go, boys. I don't th think I'll lie to you, I know be able to sense this place off. <laughs> oh no, Kiana's gonna find out about you of cheating with Elysia Raiden. Oh no, Kiana's gonna be jealous. Pardo, yeah, I've made using all our experience from the flame chasers. It's the positive kind. <laughs> they know each other well. It's so good just having the girls back together after fucking so long. Wasn't it when it comes to facing a fort? Yeah, pretty much at this point. Vague premonition about the universe behind the door. Perhaps we'll be having a lot more reunions today. <gasps> Please tell me we got to beat fucking Senti and stuff like that. I would love to. Who done it? <laughs> Who done it? I suppose trying to find out why your power is missing. Who could have taken our power besides like the fucking uh, Hersha of Dominance? Let's see outside the door. The moon beneath her was a black lunar soil, caging her with steep cliffs. Above her was boundless darkness, seemed to be devoured by the starlet. This is one of only countless pits outside the main base. Beneath her, oh wait, yeah. Empty, silent, strange, but even the frigid atmosphere could not harm the beauty of the sight. But one thing surprised her. Why was everything completely still in her eyes of the visitor who came earlier due to her gift? Senti! Even though she was the harsher sentence, as a whisper thought, she could not hold out her hand to feel her energy trickling away through muscle fibers. Still, she knew one thing for sure, she had lo lost half of her authority. For hers. <laughs> So, by following certain guidance, she entered this world. Similar to Mei, who would come soon after, the guidance was enough to make her sure sentience possessed of whose memories realized that this Bobby Eunice was perhaps located 50 or in the past. Yet there was more to the nature of that guidance. Air, sound, and even light were in perfect stillness as if a supreme being had pressed the pause button. If she was not the avatar of sentence, we should she would have likely have lost mobility like them. Unlike the girls who were yet to come other, her power was restricted and still allowed her to extend intangible spiritual synapses to interact with her surroundings more efficiently. The feeling of stagnation inside her gave her an idea of the loss of power, but soon she rejected it. <laughs> no one's stronger than me! Giga Chad. Oh, it's a robot. So, but she could feel free male as a pilot. Turn so the for the mail and envelop the pilot inside. The hush returns can still read minds of ease. Kevin? 
The instant they connect to a familiar, revolting feeling made her grasp her cuts for her length. Oh! Memories gushed towards her. Yet, contrary to most telling memories, his contained nothing. It was only pure emotion wrapped in the bulb. But her quick reaction saved from repeating the mistake. But the vast void stood left her speechless. Since this place still fell still, this person had been stuck in her mobile body while awake. Until his consciousness wore away into nothingness, leaving only his last emotion behind. How tortured would that be? Even someone with a mind like her was repulsed by the mere thought of it. And that was not the most surprising thing. Oh. Inconsistently long restraint destroyed his willpower, yet his residue was still burning with hope. Seemingly after innumerable years of suffering, the last in his last moments of his mind, he remained faithful in the light that never came. Pray Kevin or some shit, you know? It's always Kevin. I love just fucking Sally City. That's fucking such Giga Chad energy. Just this cross arms while on the sword. Whoa, I forget how fast the fucking sword goes. Hmm. We touch the mind to avoid another damn burst. The exact same as the last mine is not a speck of awareness on his tenacious hope. It's true that the deep despair can often nurture the most unrealistic hope because of them humans would have nothing better to do, but her familiarity with awareness led to her discovery. But even a breach, she more or less felt signs of it. The hope was clearly directional, sustained by a concrete being, and. She knows in the past nothing ever sparked purity more than the unreasonable qualities of humans. She may not want to destroy what others believe in, but whenever they showed unusual strong belief in external things, she would get competitive for no reason. She had to prove those things are unreliable. Hoping to find a solution to this hope, she reached into the mind again. The thing in front of her, which used to be human, seemed more pathetic than ever. I love, I love Senti. Senti's literally just like, they, these guys worship someone? I'm better than the person they worship. Fuck that guy. Why don't they worship me? Oh, Dr. May. Just like that, a nobody. She felt disappointed it was inevitable as this person could not look more average. Yet to her, she also felt so kind of anger. She asked because the harsh of sentence, just as she easily sensed the lingering hope a moment ago, she could also sense other feelings in a human brain. Such as the despair that was the exact opposite of hope and too thick to dispel was overflowing for the woman in front of her. She could not understand which angered her, someone who was deeply trusted, whose existence could inspire hope in those consciousness was dying. Someone like that sank into despair and apparently gave up in the same situation. For her, she was ending undoubtedly a revolting betrayal. Considering the power she could still channel, she was certain that she could resist the effect of repeated contact. But as she approached the other's body with fighting for justice in her mind, she does not remember a key that she should have. Although samples were insufficient so far, the absolute trust that this woman displayed appeared to be a common phenomenon among a certain group back then, back in the era that Fua had witnessed. You. When she saw the other's face, it was already too late psychologically. Oh, so they've already met up. That concluded her flashback. The girls who followed the guidance here had joined her. All existing Hershers were imprisoned in a special bubble universe. Their speculation was verified. In the meantime, she briefed them on the moon bubble universe without telling them that she had sprinkled false information. 
And so the only witness did not objectify to a statement made by the Hushi sentience. It became increasingly difficult to disturb what was false. But either way, when the girls entered this uh, bubble universe, the first people they saw were the strangely acquainted Hushi sentience and Dr. May. They know Dr. May? I didn't know about that. Why do you do everything that this May says? Why do you look so much like her subordinate? Having read between the lines, she looked around and walked unnaturally to May's side to assert herself. Yet she knew this was temporary. As soon as she relaxed, she would display reverence and reliance again, just as those pathetic minds trapped in bodies for tens of thousands of years. <laughs> They, these two haven't met, I don't think. But you're the same person! <laughs> the same person! She would know her through the flame chasers. でも私が勝手 すでに寿命が過ぎたこの世界の泡を保つことで運命の大撃を起こだと Wait, what is she call her? Senti. Which towards her? Show immediately name. Going silence, but they previously learned this new. Now they can find they're stranded. Wow. Mmm, interesting. This is a problem that's the previous era. Yeah. Mm-hmm. うん。やっぱりいなくあの件に関して松をどう。はい。結局の探してや。私には私は。それって<笑> 
もうすぐ死ぬ人間を相手なんてさ気を吐かぬけどもう読者もいやもう一度計画をまた立てね計画を進行したがる方針をそして私はこのせそれを前提とするとこの世界のあの、so、それは不可能ではないけど、少し難しい。私の疑問はそこに協力しようと言いますが、ここで聞きすぎその意見は一理あるわね。そこで、この世界を道具にしてもいいと。確かにこれは嬉しそうだね。確かにこれは嬉しそうだね。じゃあ、それから、知恵私たちが有する条件を確認するために。私は前に話してた腹を割って話すと、この世界の中で終焉の力士は、ああ、直接会うこともできるのね。ああ、落ち着いて、百聞は一線に近づく。とにかく、終焉の力士は、こういう世界を滅ぼした瞬間に、私たちに作ったんだ。気をつけ、それは違うわ、ブローニー。成功計画が、ただ、私は彼女の団員として、大半の質問もっと分かりやすい言い方に変えましょう当時簡単な話し合いの後<咳>私たちはその信号に向かうつまり<咳>こういう世界のケビンが<咳>それだといいむしろ外部の世界にでも好奇心旺盛なあなたたちとにかく<咳>私は成婚計画に対する<咳>残った思考能力で<咳>あなたの声をかけるのは、それはつまり、一時的なものじゃ、先ほどメイメイさんと会った時の、私が、ええ、肩入りを避けるため、ティアナちゃん、私の番は安心して、用事さあ、キアナ、ちょっと、キアナは、ビッツ、スローだ、but she got it in the end. Fucking Naruto run, baby. We. We. Oh shit, it's Tasha's. Yeah, Hongai beast. As I said, apart from. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wait, no, I forget you meant a normal attack until that bar runs out and then you use the ability. Hersha of Finality. Oh! It's a big statue. But I'll um, hear my get some powers from it. True. It's very impressive about this. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, where? Speed. You okay? Oh, she is dying. What? Especially with a dying person. That's box. Oh no. An unusual bridge. This privilege of you, essential. Air promise number 17, yes. Um. Hmm. Many of them may pick up head or adjust the position. Throw it at the broken bridge and I'm. Oh. She fell down the pebble land belly halfway to the destination. Ah. <laughs> if 
Spanish and Pair, I didn't fall in so I was just gone. Yeah, like before. Yes. Mm hmm Like Kiana. She always knew she wasn't qualified to empathize with either of the two. あ。だって、フレ。確かに不可能なように例えば。数だ。あ、ウォッスーデットアナバハッシュンテンズアリスカヴンデンデプライベートオブユーパワー。ああ。なんか天気にも来る。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。
No, right now, I, I think I can get out on my own. <laughs> Prefer psychology and senti. You space to devour the two scared. Keanu wore a smug face while Senti looked like she just ate something foul. <laughs> I love Senti so much. Just be basically a toddler. ことはいいでしょう。ちゃんと説明して。今簡単だよ。メイ博士は負けず嫌いなあんたを彼女の目的はあんたに渡そうとそこに。ああ。あなた、いや、違う。二人とも頭がおかしいとしか考えない。でも
turns on with the grace, like he sees upon the two girls. <laughs> I know about your life with Wild Surf and Reed's gathered cover intelligence, but it's not the same as experiencing. Trying to take your opinion properly, but in the end, she decided to be frank. ネイネイさんと。いや、exactly。パスクマンス。誰の意思がブローニャから今のネイネイさんとキアナは。Yes。誰かが。ありがとう。どういたします。ソニーさんは just you know, I don't go easy on anyone, even Olivia. She's probably confused why they're fighting. Senti. I love Senti so much. <笑>分かっては、それ以上言わなくて大丈夫。状況はもう把握。じゃあ、もう出発。<笑> That's what you do. <laughs> that may exactly reverse psychology. Senti's gonna join because it's like, yeah, we got enough people. We don't need the fourth. And Senti's just like, well, okay, you'll come then. <laughs> literal child and that's why Cindy's fucking hilarious the best character <laughs> she may be a dumbass but my god uh, to be fair dumbasses are like my favorite characters like drake and nikki of course senti in this i love naive like dumbasses with a good heart She's gonna split off on her own, yeah. <clears throat> she wants to try and find the thing before us, most likely, to prove herself. Uh oh! Robots. Interesting. Robots. Makuyayone. How many times do you say that? <laughs> oh, we're back on this bit of the moon. <clears throat> Wink. I fucking click that and just zoom past. I am dumb. Uh oh. Bang. Oh, interesting. Yeah, you can feel. Uh oh! Use the power of the void. I thought that would do something. Oh, our HP is draining fast. Senti. Oh. Number 
それはむしろあなた自身を守るここの抑制装置が設置されてから見知らぬ歴史だ起源は皇帝セッサーフオリジンあなたは彼女の体舐めて十七号という呼び方の方がそこから離れてくださいただの残骸でも私のような前衛になったとしてもそれから滲んでる崩壊エネルギーはあなたそれ以上危険な真似をするのメイセンさん何と言えばいいのでしょうエシティアナが来てくれたのだけそうだったでも彼女は私に危害を加えようとしてないよそれに The word person Tota had indicated. Kanari Likas Yasuhi to Deo Kairikotokurai, Aishikashi. Wait, it's very inconvenient. It's very convenient for me to replace my arms. This probably means inconvenient. Oh. ドクター。私は悪の<笑> ハス。ネヘレス、いや。ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニヘレス、ニ
well enough to give a certain patient observers a chance to transmit their voices along a fleeting connection through the world's boundary to her. Lots of work. Who? Pimico? Or Durandal? あなたが殺しに必要な人を殺すと思うと聞いて生きる説明で人類の呪いを殺す。中英コースの残骸に何か異常なことを聞き込んでいる崩壊を裏切るために何も知らない彼女の気難は少し大げさじゃないかしら。
Fuhr took two steps forward, moving with proud stance, lowered her head, and saw his expression for the first time. Oh, look. Mm. He wants to die. But he wants to die having, like, achieved something. <laughs> She had met her on the hours ago. The girl vividly remembered that she had just came to train again and waved hello to her. And then the world spun in. She found herself on the moon and alone. She could not activate her spatial spatial artifacts in merit and only managed to confirm her adjustment was alive by a week's not. The Bobby universe inside her is still attacked. However, any beings outside them became a mystery to her. Which is exactly the reason why others, when the other repaired that broken bridge across space for she immediately captured that vital sign and established a miraculous connection with her. No, this is no miracle. This... Is her younger self, even if they were separated. Yeah. Yeah, because of the same person, pretty much. Hmm. ハカセは私たちが男女を修復したのは、その後私たちは… <laughs> うん。ありがとう。選んだる。もし最終点。well, from the sounds of it, yeah. Hmm. No. ヨルムたち、私たちが橋を修復したことについて言い合ってる。ヴェイヴン。その直行列ってまさかあの時空ちゃんたちは夜ムンガンダの空ちゃんの家は覚えてる。あの時直行列で。じゃあ。あ。で
Ah, there we go. Oh, and then I just jump off. Oh, okay, that's convenient. Oh, that was... Whoa, that was close. Jump. Hey! Silly. Ah! I was, I was very confused when the game put me into Sealy. I didn't think we'd still be fighting these Gremoids. <laughs> Just boxing glove the shit out of them. There we go. Fucking mash that bitch into oblivion. Hee hee hee. Tee hee. Goodbye. Ah oh, shit, we got we got Chungus. A certified Chunker. Bonk. Oh, I want to go. I want to go bike mode. I want to go bike mode. Wait, give me a moment. I'll go bike mode in a moment. But I need to do this. Bike mode! Ride on. Whee! Oh, I want to ride the bike more. その失態者の追っ払れはまだでしたよね。やっと戻ってきたんだ。ファイブ。that is fair, yeah. Marie, ケビンの成功計画を知らない。そう、そう。私たちの計画の中、あなたたちも黒目天使に尋ねたでしょ。うん。それってつまり、私たちは何となくあるよ。そんな状況でも、あなたたちに手伝う。うん。どうしてケビ
Those are integral parts. Ah, I see. Move day. Yeah. <laughs> if you do what you're looking to. It might even end up wasting your fresh, but don't forget time is on the side. Using the husk will get you back to your one in the shortest possible time. We want to try. Any more to pray. <coughs> How many enjoy reacting? <laughs> Create the vision, got rid of the nostalgia, is leaving the creation to give off tea of smell. It's about the success of renormalization. In the account, uh, yes. <coughs> These are the power for the edge of time that I should be able to possess you and break the change. Hush is to restrain Hush's power. Ah. Yeah. Remember not to be too <laughs> May. Lips curled slightly. <laughs> She's angry that she didn't choose her. Of course I chose May. They are the lesbians. If it was Seely, I would have chose Bronya. ちょっと、ね、けど、私自身も別の人格性。一方的に、本当の律者なんだから、互いの心と体が均等に開かれた時期やな。体と心。うん。イニシエの楽園に出入りした経験を生かし、でも、具体的に感情はいろんな。あな
たか最初の場所がここだなんて思わなかった Hamako Oh, Hamako, yeah. Gemma Pace. <laughs> Somebody told me. Close her eyes and took a breath and counted as calmly as she could. <clears throat> Left giving up. Those old fantasies. He likes to talk about final goodbyes, but it can be avoided. I'm the Hush Avoid, and I thought we'd change that. We all hope. We prepare. <laughs> <laughs> Keanu probably told Boronia, the class president and the principal. I'm not sad, I've grown, I'm doing well. These are all things she said when they were all true. But she couldn't help but fear her innocence had been lost to time, as Raiden Mace had once been. So, seemingly in spring play such a important role in our lives. Mm -hmm. To Ruben, have a drink. Oh, I would have loved to see her in the dress, although there is a wedding dress version, which is base. Oh. She winked at May and smiled as before. You also missed the stars, yeah. Oh. It's a really good chapter for like connecting back May and Kiana. Mm. Oh, this is May's past, yeah. Well, May's story. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> to defeat the Hushka, the Fenjis have become Sims themselves. It's touching by heart that lasts. Elysia, the most beloved of them, told me. Fisher and Pepe, don't be swift along by time. Commission, they left the beauty they protected. We pass on successes like us. Oh shit. Tell them for as long as you want. Hell yeah. These two really just need like a fucking vacation at the end of all this. Just let them go to like a fucking beach somewhere. Just chill. All the way from the beginning of the game, when I had no idea what this game was going to be like. Before I truly got hooked on the game during chapter 5. And then final lesson, which pretty much cemented me into Honkai. <laughs> S so it should be just say. <coughs> Mason, 
<laughs> this is so nice, just getting these two back together. <laughs> that is very, yeah. もう一度白桃味の<笑> Yeah, so you were relating to Oh, she wants it to be bright. I thought that was some uh, other meaning there. <laughs> Makes the most sense for combat. <laughs> True. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> May's words easily stir the web formed by her thoughts. When the web stopped wobbling, the th thread of thought naturally stopped there. That's right. Kiana knew well that day she wouldn't get around to discussing with May what they need to talk about. After that thought, her mind fell into deep silence like a computer powering down. And yet her mind was working overtime to rebuild everything at a breakneck pace. They're perfectly in balance. As they should be. Oh, this is the Night of Naganazora. Where they fought. This is the day they fought, yeah. Like appearing at a ball, yeah. <laughs> True, yeah. <laughs> Are they gonna spar? Who's thought so she comes to heads over what to say and do when the emotions. Science trying to separate the two of comfortable distance. <laughs> Just like that day. Atmosphere. Yeah, it's a nice sunset. Aww. Yeah. That's really how Kiana thinks. I have to take all these screenshots. I can't not take these screenshots. Like, holy shit. Hmm. The best way. Exploring affairs and beginning distance together. Normally, most people prefer to avoid science between conversations if it was a pair of scissors that would snip the friendship apart. Conversation is a meaning after too much silence. I disagree. I think just hanging with someone in silence, being comfortable in each other's presence is a perfect sign of friendship. Science ironically help merge their thoughts and experience each other's emotions. <laughs> it was wrong. 
って<笑>でも逆に考えるとつまりキアナちゃんのことメイクの場合<笑>コーナーでボール二<笑>人は笑った目があった瞬間ハデアチェフキアラズボイスその最後の瓦礫もおメイ先輩ん知ってると思うけどヘリオスに戻ったそのたくさんの誰かの中で Zuka and place her mouth. I can't remember whether she began to speak again. But I may say, by what sort of misogyny, Tada, what I know, Sibeti, Kusi, Seka, and Tamini Tatakau. First, fight for all that is beautiful. Yep. May all this beauty be blessed. Oh, so no, it's Christian and Nakade. Motomo took a bit in a tonsai. I mean, this was May. She can never forget the words one said to her. You're more important than the world. Yep. She been waiting for an opportunity to respond. Not that she had need to, but she wanted to. She knew that if she spoke on Maya wouldn't be the answer May wanted to hear the most. But at this moment, she wanted to let her know how she felt in this way. She meant to realize she's saying ahead. もし私が少し先の今の私は多分まあ言うそれはきっとキアナちゃんと一緒でも結局のところしょうがないの私が世界を好きにキアナちゃんあ to say a few seconds later she finds Carol the most efficient reply to think of 私もメイ先輩が思う私 I agree with the way her thoughts started to dance before she realized the view had shifted again where to now theater of domination Hey, I fucking guessed it. Naganazora. Oh. Huh. Oh, yeah. <coughs> oh, this is when she fought the husk. <coughs> Kurikara. I stood on my side. She was conquered. She's gone, yeah. Right now, she's saving for a very simple reason. She knew you'd be sad if. Aww. Siren, yeah. Exactly. Well, maybe not that. Being held prisoner in a dream space built by someone else, cares or strange, is such experience, yep. Continue the dark side of the moths, yep. Go face to face. See knowledge and tech from the previous era while ignoring the thorny ladder, yeah. Yeah. Cut the thorns, exactly. This can go beyond fire as you reach future. Who says we can't do better? Exactly! They lowered her eyes and touched her blade. As if alive, the handle became warm and glowed red faintly. Kuri Kada. It's the husk! Concerned, tried by a huge blade dropping from the sky. Remind Bakana made her a blade. She knew clearly that the girl was coming here. The real spiritual restraint. Here's the fuck face. Let's fucking dance, you fucking. Owl, owl. <gasps> oh, we're both. We're both weak to it. This feels just like old times fighting together, baby. Just like the beginning of the game. Bonk, 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 Oh, 
Kiana! Nee. Charge. I'm trying to hit it. Oh! In one strike. They just... Oh, they're both back to their Hersha forms. Flame Scion and Hersha Thunder. Let's go. I felt the shame running through, even every reflex improved. You should all. May looked where the magic crunched a massive light emerge. That's what you anticipate. <laughs> Long it didn't step. Behind the exit was an the imminent crisis just at last time. The clock would start to tick the second they left. They need to break the restraint of Prince to put on the Hershes first and confront Kevin Kasana and maybe the finality lurking behind him too. After seconds of silence, someone moved. She took the hand of the other and said something she had rehearsed in her heart time and time again. Oh, it's so good. Best partner. If I've got the better of May, we'll pay it back. Uh, I'm probably going to stop here for today because I've been going for two and a half hours. Uh, I will do this at least next talk bit and then I'll end. Fall from a dream. This time Kiana got the new answer, the warm touch of a close one. Her sense of touch came back to her first, coming back from the mind space. First thing Kiana felt was her hands amazed and the sense of smell. So the drive for sure made her so special and in her hearing. So then the two girls burst and laughed at the same time. <laughs> Doing they both dreamed of countless nights. Night. When you're not 100% yourself. Oh, it's because May is like 100 people. The two of them figure and start to look at the surroundings. Maybe it was to help themselves emerge as the mind space, or maybe it was to avoid embarrassment. Anyway, Dr. May was not there to guide them. Oh, there's Bronya. Right, I'm going to end it there for today. That was really good. Getting finally Kiana and May being back together and having their little character moment was fucking adorable and I'm so happy. But either way, yeah, that'll be today's stream. Next week will probably be more Honkai or maybe just something else if I feel like chilling like Bow bit remastered or whatever. But I hope you all did enjoy the stream. I hope you all stay safe, stay hydrated, and I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Oh shit, I've almost done chapter. Yo, I've almost done the chapter. Because then look at all that. We've still got a long way to go.